Hey, what is going on, everybody? Scott Game in here. Thank you very much for joining us. As you can see, we're back. We're playing some more. Red Dead 2. We're in the epilogues uh, of the story. Um, and I don't really know what to expect. I guess we're going to find out how Good morning. John ends up outside Fort Wallace, right? I think. Um, ow! Jesus! I think I let one of the balls out. That's not a good start to your first day, right? Do you reckon I can get it back? Have I got a lasso? I don't even think I've got one. Got a camera? Nothing. Oh well. Well, that's bad news. I'm in trouble on day one, aren't I? Oh well. Oh god, what was that groan? Milton, get over here. Mr. Geddes, this is the new ranch hand I told you about. Well, I heard you had some trouble with your welcome, but you kept your nerve and protected my property. No, it was nothing, sir. Hmm. I'm David Geddes. Pleased to meet you. John, Jim, hmm. Milton. Thank you. Well, Mr. Dickens, well, you work hard. You be honest. You'll get your keep. I promise you that. Boy has a family. Oh, lucky man. Then you better work extra hard. Good day, Howdy, sir. gentlemen. Sir. You hear that, John, Jim? Extra hard. Hey, hey, get over here. Mr. Dickens, go find old Jim Milton here something to do. Make sure he works extra hard. Sure, Mr. Dickens. He knows, right? He just knows. What do we do now, I wonder? Come on this way. I, I was on my chores anyhow. Okay, don't worry about the lack of a bull. Is your family getting in the... Wagon up there? Ah, oh, believe it is. Mind if we go welcome them? Not at all. Hey, is it true what they said about you when you arrived? It, that you ran off those hired guns? Look, can we uh not discuss this in front of my wife? Oh, uh, no. Sure. Yeah, of course, Mister. Thanks, buddy. I don't want to worry her. Oh yeah, I hear that. Mrs. Milton! Jim Milton, how fine you seem. <laughs> this kind man just collected us. Thank you, sir. I think we can be okay here. It's ranching work. This place is kind of... It's fine. But I hear you began your career in ranching by throwing your weight around. Real wise, Jim. What was I supposed to do? The place was getting robbed. So you show everyone who's boss? Real fine. I didn't have much of a choice. I gotta go. Jack, when you're done in here, come on out and lend a hand. Another good start. That's what I like to see. I was going to milk the cows. Come on. Oh, nice. Uh, you are gonna milk the cows? Sure. <laughs> Why not? Oh, uh, I don't know. I... I thought you was, uh... I'm a ranch hand. A new one, at that. When you got here, them hired guns? I was just getting my wagon back. That's all. Weren't nothing. Oh, it weren't nothing. It was about time someone stood up to them fellers. No. Where are you from, anyway, partner? Around, you know. Up north, mostly. Been these parts before, but that was years ago. Oh, <laughs> it's changed. The rich fellas are coming in and buying everything, the ranches. But, well, it ain't as wild as it once were, at least. There is that. See, if it ain't too personal a question, are you a gunslinger, mister? <laughs> Good lord, no. Nothing like that. Now, just a ranch hand, then. Just a ranch hand. Failed at a bunch of things, like most men. <laughs> well, I feel a whole heap better having a ranch hand like you around. That is for sure. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see how you feel once you see me work. <laughs> <laughs> All right, then. Here's the cows. Here's a cow. Yeah, we 
used to have a bunch of women here did most of the milking. But most of them drifted off. Okay. You fine with milking? You know, I ain't really done much of it. Could never, never really get the hang of it. You serious, mister? Sure. It's Jim. Jim Milton. Hey, sit down, I'll show you how. Oh, no. Calm now. She don't take too kindly to surprises. Look at me go. I'm milking everybody. I'm not milking everybody. You know what I mean. Me, I'm an old pro already. Hey, Pa. Is that your boy? Sure. Hey, Lancelot. Well, hey, Lancelot. Hey. We're gonna make a dairy maid of your pa yet. <laughs> Look at me go. I never thought I'd see the day. Watch and learn, partner. We all gotta earn our keep. That's enough, Jim. Come on. How about you and the boy uh, help me clean out the stables? Sure. Come on, son. Anyone gonna take these milk pails? Oh, hello. Now, Twelve, sir. Ain't that grand. It's such a fine name. I like it. I got I got imaginative parents, sir. <laughs> I can tell. Now, it ain't pleasant work, but it's gotta be done. Mr. Dickens said I know what he said. We'll do it. Won't we, boy? Mm -hmm. He's not going to be happy. Oh, God. Okay. Well, you get them stalls cleaned out, and I'll see you later. Bye. Okay. Jack, let's just try and take some pride in this work, hard as it may be. Boy, bring that wheelbarrow over here and keep it close to me. Yes, sir. Oh, I don't have to pick up that. Hold on a moment. Oh, God. You're a long way from Angelo Bronte's mansion now. Sorry, sir. Nothing. What? What? Hold on. This is a dog's work. Yeah, I can't see us doing this for too long. That stinks. What do you expect, mate? You know where it came from. Oh, God. Last one. The terror of the turds. Oh, not the last one. Reckon even your mother would say we're almost done here. You finish things up, I'll go check on her. Okay. Lancelot. <laughs> Let's get over there. I still can't believe I let their prize bull run away. Punch horse, would you look at that? Hey. Hey. Where's Jack? Shoveling shit in pursuit of the better life you want. <laughs> Same as I've been. Won't do him no harm. I know. Guess maybe we can last here. Survive. Do a little better than survive for once. I'm tired of fleeing, John. So, well, you know. Me too. What happened to the money, the bag of cash from the, the train, I wonder, that Tilly had on the back of the... the horse? Where did all that go? Mm -hmm. 
Where did all that go? I'll put some coffee on. Here we go again. Another day. Oh, okay. Have a cheeky little save in here. Let's see what we've got in store for us today. Hey, Milton. Can you give me a hand with this fence? Love to. Sure. Know much about fence building? Not really. <laughs> can't build a fence, can't milk a cow, ain't used to shoveling shits, but took on a gang of robbers single-handed. Guess we all got our peculiarities, Mr. Dickens. What was you doing before you came here? I told you. Wife got cheated out of inheritance. We was in a legal dispute. It was a bad time. That sounds awful, but I guess I don't believe a word of it. I was raised to take a man at his word, and also to believe this is a free country. So free that I can't tell you what to think. So I guess it don't much matter what you believe. But I will work hard, and I learn fast. Okay. Give me a hand with this fence. You tell him, John. Yep. There's plenty more to do. Pound it in there. We don't want it coming down. You're holding that hammer all wrong. Line it up with a notch and place it in. Now, lift up the other side. They got to line up, see? Now the next rail. I mean, this doesn't look the most secure. Fine. Good. Doing all right. Thanks, buddy. What are you doing? That looks okay. Go to the next post and pound that in. I hope you've grasped the basics. I got other matters to attend to, but yeah, I got it. A day's work here for you. All right. So long. I'll be counting sections when you're done. Okay. I got this. Look at me go. Jeez. Jim Milton, over here. Put that fence down and get over here, boy. I've almost finished. Is this the bull that we let run away? I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Milton, get over here. coming. You're going to make me stand behind it. Much about bulls, Milton? No. Uh, just the basics. Don't make them mad. Angus Geddes, this is Jim Milton. Mr. Milton, Angus is your boss's son. Nice to meet you. Well, let's try and move this great hunk of Chuck. I know how it Come is. on, move. Come on. Ouch. Whoa. Get him. Well, now I've got a lasso. Oh, come on. That was my fence. I gotta build that. Bad ball. Jesus. Oh, no. Here we go again.
This is not the way, right? Ouch. Anyone got a gun? Oh, shit. Jesus. Come on. Let's talk. How am I going to calm this thing down? You don't look like you're going to wind down. <laughs> but I'll try. It ain't so Oh my god. Oh shit. Shoot. That didn't seem much like a dive. Please calm down. Please calm down. There, there. There, there. All better? Okay. <laughs> now come on, you hunk of chuck. This way. Got him, Mr. Dickens. Oh, good. How you doing, son? A bit sore, but I'll be okay. Thank you, Mr. Milton. My pleasure. And you, mister? Fine. He just got my head. Good. There he is. See you later, Jim Milton. We'll make a rancher of you yet. <laughs> what a day. Putting up fences, having fences knocked down. Jeez. And Dawson still on day three. to work today myself, Jack. Huh? So you stay out of trouble. Where are you working? I told you. I'm cleaning at the doctor's office. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> Get the place to tidy. Okay, Pa. I'll see you later. Now what? I got three bucks. He's around here somewhere. Where are my other hands? Damn it, Abe. I said, Abe, yes, where are the other hands? Uh, I thought I said I don't rightly know, Mr. Getty, sir. Well, what good is that to me? We got three horses lost, possibly more, a mare about to foal, sir, and no hands to help with any of it. I'm supposed to be heading into town. This place is chaos. Hey, Pa! Can I get some help? Pa! Milton, Milton, you good with horses? I'm okay. I'll do whatever needs doing, sir. Uh, good man. Can you help my boy, my youngest, Duncan? He will insist on riding Jeremiah, a horse that is far too strong for him. And my wife will need help with this mare. Abe? Sir? You and Dickens better not make any more mistakes like you did today, you hear? No, sir. Thank you. Both of you. See you, mate. Come on, he's over here. I'm good. You get on. Go find them horses. No, no, no. I'll show you. Since you showed up, runaway horse has been to some of our problems. And I am thankful for that. I ain't done too much. I ain't much of a rancher. Oh, heck. Hey, maybe them Laramie boys weren't so tough after all. Hmm? Maybe I could have handled them. Of course you could. They're just loud mouths. Yeah. So, uh, is that what the boss is doing in town? Some business with them boys or something? Oh, when Mr. Geddes goes into town, well, it ain't oh, no. exactly for, uh, business. Oh, uh, okay then. All right. He'll be just at the end there. Well, I better get to. Thanks, kid. Oh, God. Very deep. <laughs> okay. Here we go. You Duncan? I'm Jim. Jim Milton. Hey. Need a hand with that horse? No. Whoa. 
<laughs> you sure about that? Okay, yes. Yes, I do. Pretty big one. <laughs> That's Jeremiah. Okay, Jeremiah. There, boy. Oh, hey, easy now. Whoa, none of that. Come on. Easy, boy. Oh, someone put some onions on their oats, didn't they, boy? Oh, calm down. Why is it so spooked? I ain't sure he likes any of us, but I'll make him respect me and behave. Can't you teach me how to make him behave same way as he does for you? I'm supposed to go help your mother. She's got a horse in full. That'll take hours. Well, training a horse can take hours. Just give me a quick lesson, sir. Please. Okay. Let me ride him a bit first. Get some of the spunk out of him. Okay. I'll wait um, for out. Um, okay. I'm just going to despunk this horse. Let's go. Come on. Let it all out of you. you. Got some energy? Show me then. Let's get a lather up. Oh, Jesus. All right. He's ready for you. Okay. Get on up there and go nice and slow. <laughs> Stay calm. Me? The horse. You're calm. My heart's beating a little. Keep your voice calm and your legs strong. Don't let old Jeremiah sense fear. I won't. Doing fine. Real nice. Not that I'm saying you need one, but you sure there isn't another horse for you to ride around here? I had a pony, but I'm too grown for him now. Yeah? You think my son could borrow him? Huh? Lancelot? Yeah. Sure. I'll get it hitched by your cabin there. All right. Thank you, son. Can I ask, are we in trouble from all these Laramie boys? They say Mr. Abel's real rich, way richer than Pa, and he's got all these hired guns out of Laramie, and if Pa doesn't sell, well, they'll come here and they'll... Hey, easy there. You don't have to worry about all that. You just worry about Jeremiah there. Yeah, but... But... Just worry about the horse. Yeah? Yes, sir. I think you two might be ready to go out without a chaperone. Oh, I'm not sure about that. You're good. Nice and easy now. Both of you. I think we know what's happening here, right? Never to be seen again. That's me. I thought you were going to help me. I am. I was. I'm sorry. Come on. I need a man's help. Duncan, what have I told you about distracting the hands? I'm sorry, Ma. <sighs> well, I hope you'll listen to me better than my Thank husband. Thank you, Mr. Milton. You're doing fine, kid. Give him a carrot when you put him down. This is the stall. Here we go.
So, you know much about birthing a foal milk? Nothing. Not too much. My God, where does my husband find men like you? Still, we all know where he goes in town, and it ain't hunting for hands. It's not too hard. You just uh, stick a hand in there and get a feeling for where the legs are. Go on. Oh, what do you say, ma'am? God. Okay, now hold on. Didn't come. Okay. It's coming out one way or another. Grab them again. Oh. oh. Okay, well, I think she's... Well, we're not out of the woods, but I think she may be okay. Great. We'll make a proper hand of you yet, Mr. Milton. I hope so. Thank you. Oh, and Mr. Milton, feel free to make a call at the house sometime. Perhaps even now. A drink to toast our new arrival. <laughs> I'd like that, but my wife is expecting me back. Oh, you're married? I didn't know we had any married hands. Oh, I see. Yeah. We we have a boy. Maybe you've seen him around? Oh, uh, I'm I'm busy. Uh, too busy for social calls. Of course. Good day. Oh, Mr. I Milton. see. He gets to go to town, quite literally. And she has her pick of the the hands, so to speak. Wowza. Back home we go again. Hey, John. Jim. <sighs> Sorry. <laughs> so, this is what you wanted. Fake names, which, by the way, Dickens sees clean through. John. Us on the run. John, this is our chance to make something new. Come on. Please. For me. For him. How's he been? Been kind of withdrawn. Quiet. You know. Sure. Take him out, please. Come on, boy. Let's go for a walk. Come on. Round to the left. What do you see? The pony? Get on him. We're taking a ride. Duncan, Mr. Getty's boy lent it to you. Let's go. How you doing? Fine. Can we go home? No. You're... Stay calm. Where would you like to go riding, aside from home? I don't know. But maybe that stream? Good idea. Now you know all this. Get him going. Come on. You know. The horse can feel your fear. Just act confident, okay? Uh-huh. Confident. Yep. Don't pull on the reins. You'll yank his bit out. Use your legs. There you are. Now let's go. Jack, a little kick and a... Jack, slow. Easy there. Why don't we speed it up again? Okay. Come on. Yeah. See, you can do it. 
How about you speed up a mile? Okay. Even faster, come on. Faster? Whoa! Pull him in. You're in control of this. Easy. Rain him in now. Show him who you are. Whoa! Look at us in charge of a in charge of a horse. Giving lessons to our son. Whoa! Let's bring up the pace again. Alright. If you say so, sir. Yeah. You know, this ain't so bad, sir. Good. Amazing what the right horse and a little confidence can do. Look at that deer just run into a tree. Think you're ready for a little race? I guess. All right. We go back to the path and up to the ranch. Okay. On my go. Go! I mean, it seems a little unfair. My horse versus that little horse. Oh god. Are you still back there? Bumping me around. Have some of this. How do you like this, huh? I'm winning. It's almost like I'm letting you win. Little shit. Right, let's keep going. We're almost back. said you're riding it's gotten so much better thanks hey keep practicing your riding you too <laughs> you need it what's the uh what's the shooting going on what was that all about i'm pretty sure i had shooting right your mouth boy you will be the first one we kill leave him alone <laughs> oh careful boys careful yeah. look at this tough guy get out of here how oh, fancy pants get he's paying you to be tough for him huh <laughs> <laughs> no he's paying me to keep the place clean oh. said he had some problems with vermin 
Oh, listen to this. Real funny. <laughs> no! Oh, 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 get him! Oh, get him! Oh, kick his head in, Bob! Ow! Yeah! Get his spins on women! Shades on hands! Black is good! Oh, boy! They didn't hire you because you're tough. It's because you're stupid. Oh, he's licking you, boss. <laughs> when was the last time you had a bath? You need help. Come on, now. Get off that man. Get off him. He hit me first. Oh, you can fight, boy. I'll give you that. Well, how's your wife in a brawl? Leave my wife alone. Oh, she's real pretty. Get out of here. Oh, quite a temper you got. <laughs> Imagine you're you're frustrated with your lot in life. Married to a shit shoveling farmhand. <laughs> <laughs> well, what'd you do wrong to end up here? Leave my wife alone. Welcome to Big Valley, Jim Milton. Pleasure to meet you both. We'll see you again. And you, boy, tell Mr. Geddes we called. We'll be back. <laughs> well, well, well. Mr. Milton, thank you. Don't worry about it. You stop acting like a goddamn storybook hero, will ya? What choice did I have? Plenty, you moron. <laughs> Plenty. <laughs> Any for that, is there? Poor old John, Jim. Just trying to do his best. We all get caught eventually, John. I guess the trick is to decide by who. hear any of it not in front of the men you toad all right smile smile do not embarrass me hmm mr gettys hey i heard we had another incident with the uh, laramie boys yeah there was an incident well, i mean to scare me are you scared a little I've got a lot invested in this place, and, and not just the land, but, but my family. It's, uh, it's hard to explain. I understand. I'll do my best to keep you safe, sir. Uh, I know you will. So how's your family? Uh, just fine. I should probably head back. <laughs> yeah, I know how it is. <laughs> How'd you get on? Okay, I guess. Better? Sure, I'm just tired. I know. Anybody want some more? Uh, no, no, I'm thank good. You. <laughs> I miss Mr. Pearson. John Marston, you're such a pig. <laughs> All right, it's getting late. Let's get some rest. No, it ain't much. Good night, Jack. Good night, Mama. Good night, Jack. Good night, Pa. What the hell was that? What are you, what are you doing? My job, Abigail. Lock this door behind me. Don't open it unless you know it's me. Oh, man. They just took on. And I heard about you. Jim, you know that offer? It's you. They've killed Mr. Tobert, and they've stolen my goddamn cattle. You men okay? I think so. Yeah. Jim Milton saved my life. It's Mr. Abel. Yeah, of course, it's Mr. Abel. 
I can't believe he thinks he can scare me out of here. Then I guess we're getting your cattle back, I guess sir. we are. Can you go too, Tom? Of course, sir. All right, Jim. I know you can handle yourself. A little. Go get your guns and head out. Guns? Oh, don't play coy with me, son. We need your help. I don't care what you used to do or what your, your, your name is. This is the land of second chances. Understood. Okay. Come in, it's me. What was it? Mr. Getty's cattle was taken. God, I'm sorry to hear that. What are you doing in that thing? Mr. Getty's been real good to us. We, I. What are you doing? My job, Abigail. My goddamn job. I didn't even put any clothes on. Go on my guns. I'll lead the way. This is gonna be the last we hear out of them. Yeah, yeah, right. Here we go. Hanging Dog Ranch. Wowza. Are they with me? They're a bit slow on the old uptake. Not like the old crew. That's the place up ahead. There's our cows. A couple guards out front. A couple more around the side, I imagine. Let's get a closer look. Let's go. Oh, we did put some trousers yeah. on there. There's plenty of guards. I'm gonna head straight in. Yep, Tom. You head up there and try and give us some cover. Abe, you're gonna try and flank the place and come in from the back. I'll give you a minute or two, then I'm heading in. Yes, sir. Okay. been coming up to pronghorn i thought i'd come down here you're all so tough come have a word with me you here to cut a deal you're too late partner i'm here for our cattle and to teach some manners to all of you <laughs> you seen how many men we got as many as money can buy now get out of here, Hayseed, before you get a hole in your head. Just shoot him! I tried being reasonable! Uh oh. They're coming, cattle! Why can't I get in cover? Nice. Little on the loud side. Is that so?
Hiding upstairs in the barn? Is that what you're doing? Oh, hello. Got the look of a woman ain't had a real ride in her life. She's gotta make do with some piss poor stinking farmhand. Hey, hey, tell her I'll let her in my sheets. As long as she bathes first in sheep dip, get the stink of you off of her. Farmhand! Some things never change, John. We should probably just have a little look, right? Should probably just have a little look upstairs. There's a gun. We can get some real food rather than what Abigail's been serving us. Anything under the sink? This has got to have something good in, right? Another cigarette card. Famous gunslingers. in here okay I think we're good to go right all these dead people here. You realise they probably burned down some more fence. What's the bet that fellow we killed is like their son or something or cousin or that has in like the, the people whose ranch we just shot up. And it's going to be personal, right? Your 
back. You did real well, Mr. Milton. This man can really fight. Save the whole place. Ah, oh. <laughs> that weren't nothing. Well, you, oh, you, <laughs> you saved my life. No need to say nothing, sir. Just doing my job. Whew. Now, I don't think they'll be back tonight, but how about Abe? Just in case you stay up. Yep. You see anything or hear anything, you fire that rifle three times. Three times. We'll all come running. Will do. Uh, well said. And thank you, Mr. Milton. Truly. Just glad to be of service, sir. <laughs> I understand. You get some rest. Thank you, Mr. Geddes. Uh oh. What? What? What choice did I have? Just answer me that. What was I supposed to do? We're going to put a cut in here. Thank you so much for watching. Please hit the like button, subscribe button, follow us on Twitter at Scott Gamer. We'll see you again soon. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, you have been watching Scott Dog Gaming. Don't forget to follow on Twitch and Twitter and head over to YouTube for daily content. See you again soon.